Hello, guys and girls. Jokester here, bringing you another episode of FTV Presents Direwolf 20. We are up to episode 9 today, and we've been doing a bit of things, right? In case you didn't notice, I, I forgot to mention, I blasted out the wall further back. I made this a full 9x9, because that's what my planter supports, and so, or my farming farmer with support so i figured eh, why not and it's doing a little bit better keeping up but you see it's just constantly running all the time um let's see anything else i've done yes aha so i have pretty this up a little bit i've got an andesite floor it's kind of a polished andesite and it's brick walls and then my wife said no we need uh we need some color so she had me put in this blue stained glass from chisel very simple to make and uh and I said, but you're going to see through it. And she's like, I know, I like that. So we can actually see the, if you look up there, you can kind of just barely see the uh, the, the um, sugarcane field up there. And so she said, that gives a character. So I kind of close this off to down to the mine. And yeah, I don't know. Well, whatever. Outside, uh, I think there's not much else other than rain. Uh, it seems to be about the same. I don't think there's anything else I've done. So, okay. But today, well, besides I get an ink sack. So the other thing is, where's my ink sacks go? Up here. So the other thing is I forgot to show you about this acceleration one. Oh my gosh. So I've been mining, of course, you know, con perpetually. I had to get a lot more redstone. Um, so I've now got 60 blocks of redstone. Uh, I've got 62 blocks of lapis lazuli. Uh, I was going to do some of the actually addition stuff and empowering, and I was going to make some greenhouse glass. Oh my goodness, that takes a lot of lapis and and a lot of resources. So I think we're going to have to hold off on that until we get some uh, some mining. So, but I saved the gold behind because we know oh by the way and uh, now that i have tons of ender pearls from my little tiny ender pearl farm up there this is on a server so it continually runs every time i log in i, I uh, get it and speaking of logging in one other thing guys i want to formally apologize i want to apologize i'm going to bow my head here i had missed a day and i am very sorry this is my second day i missed since the series have started i'm so sorry i have been very busy very very busy with work and so it was tough i got on last night and i said you know what i'm gonna upgrade we do have uh, the latest version it had come out like five hours before so now we have the cool new energy laser relay which i was very happy with so we've got new great new stuff we've got things like this immersive engineering storage crate They've changed textures, always good stuff, right? Well, I um, um, I, I had trouble getting the server going. It, it wasn't anything insurmountable. It was like, I'm going to just copy the mods over and change the Forge version. And yeah, that didn't, and the way FTV does there, so I had to change the settings, .sh file, and blah, blah, blah. Um, I ended up just cutting my losses and going out to, uh, trying to find the server for the direwolf pack and um yeah it took too long that i had to go to bed because i had to get up and you know work and stuff and i wasn't able to record last night so that's my excuse i'm sticking with it but i apologize sincerely apologize guys um i know you have lots of other content to watch and i um for those of you who were looking forward to an episode i appreciate the uh the the desire so thank you very much okay what i want to show you is this acceleration one it's pretty neat so if you find one it's great if you can make one even better it does require another star a couple of gas teals and a regular wand course so so by this time if you've got enough nether stars you, you're not too worried about blaze rods but it is very expensive hard to get early game and I have found plenty of them. It's crazy. I'm so excited of all the uh, wands. He's, this is a really, really, really neat mod pack. So the Not Enough Wands uh, mod. So the Acceleration Wand, what does it do? In case you haven't seen this, this is awesome. So it's going to dump this in here, right? And it's going to start working. And it's still pretty fast. But if I do, if I do this, okay, and I just hold this down, it's already done with that whole stack. All right, now we've got a ton in here. Well, let's accelerate. So let me just show you. If I hold shift, uh, let's see. I forgot the keystroke. Darn it. Oh, no. Well, let me just show you this real quick. Oh, now I'm really. There we go. Okay. Let's just, let's see. We have roughly a stack in there. So if we do this, you see my energy up there is going down and it's already done. So now we, right, it's instead of just running through this 
fairly slowly, it just cranks through and all of it's dumped in here. That's how awesome it is. Now it did use energy, right? It, it, it does take power, it's not free. It does uh, require power. And I now have the octatic capacitors in here, which store a lot more power, and that really helps. But um, now let me check real quick, now that I have a chance. So this is the Better Builders Wands. This was, sorry, 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 not enough wands. Okay, okay, I'm, I'm getting there, I'm getting there. Not enough wands. All right, all right, all right, all right. Not enough wands, it's semicolon. Okay, there we go. So switch to fast mode faster and fastest so you can have it at the varying speeds of course we're doing it fastest and you just well here if i right click it's going to open up the interface but i would hold this down and shift right click so that accelerates various things it's pretty neat pretty neat okay so that's all i wanted to show you about with that pretty pretty cool stuff if you ever get one or are able to make one highly highly recommend it okay today we're going to get into some immersive engineering and so immersive engineering is a really neat mod pack very very um I don't know, electrical in, or engineering, I mean, not electrical. It's it's very like mechanical engineering, like some people call it steampunk. I don't think it's quite that, but it's close. So pretty neat stuff. They do have a book, Immersive Engineering Mail. Very simple recipe, so let's make that. So we need a book. If I can get my mouse wheel to work here. And I just so have always have lever. I have made myself a lever. And we will put those together and make us ourselves a book. And the book's pretty cool. Book's pretty cool. So we go in here and, oh, I got an achievement. RTFM, read the manual. Uh, let's see, overview and resources, construction, power wire, and tools and simple, heavy machinery and computer software. What I want to do is I want to start generating some power. But we got to set up the infrastructure. Uh, in general, we're going to do some... Uh, the the not the thermoelectric we're going to do yeah we always have problems with this so, <laughs> so uh, finding what we want so let's see basic wiring yeah I'm not gonna hunt through this not gonna hunt through this what we need is the cold coke oven because we got to build the infrastructure so let's get to work on that so the first thing we need to do is we can remember we can put a space after this and put coke and so this is the mod pack with what we're looking for so we need coke brick because we're going to make a coke oven and so we're going to need a whole bunch of these well we need a three by three by three that's 27 we can only make it in evens so that'll be 28 so 28 times 4 is 56 so ultimately what we need to do is we need to make 14 packs of this so i need 14 times 4 um and then for, uh, 14 times 4 of these well yeah without doing the math we're going to do let's see what am i looking for no down here I was, I did make a whole bunch of bricks already ahead of time. And I have over here, I have a whole bunch of clay. So let's just make them. Oh, I need the smooth stand, sandstone. And that's going to be uh, uh, sand. That's what I'm looking for. That's the word. And, oh, not there. Come on, come on. Okay, so, and I'm going to have to wait for there we go. And, oh, back up, back up, back up. One of these days, that's regular sandstone. And I think think I need 14 but we'll go ahead and make all these because we got plenty of sand I'm not too worried about it so I need I need one more which is fine I'll pull these out for right now so that's going to be get me my 26 and I just need two more pieces of sand and then I can grab that mouse tweaks for the win and I can make myself one of these brilliant there's my 28 I'm going to need 27 of them so I'm also going to need some coal coal I could use a charcoal. I don't have a tree farm. I don't really need a tree farm, but I'm okay with that. So where do we want to set this up? I'm thinking, I don't know. I don't know. It would be kind of cool to, to kind of keep going over here and have these, you know, these hold these big multi-block structures. So I think that's what we want to do. So maybe we'll do one space in between the two. And I want that just to come out in front so we can see down below it, you know, like we did with the furnace there. So that's a three by three, and I'm going to grab my building wand. I haven't actually used this builder's wand yet, so we're going to see what it's like, and then we want the coke, coke brick here, and yes, yes, come on, there we go. There we go, and I meant to use this. Oh yeah, 
two, and three. And then we're going to have to hit it with our engineer's wand, which of course we did not grab. Now, the engineer's wand is pretty simple. We've made this in a previous episode when we make the IC2 stuff. So it shouldn't be that uh, big of a difference, but it or big of a deal to make. It's already there. Now, I've also gotten multiple ones of these through various... Uh, um, these storage crates and at the at the towns they have uh, the immersive engineering town there's a uh, frame with it on there so yeah that that one worked pretty good it's not not a very hard use of it but okay yay coal coal coming what this does is this inputs coal outputs uh, I forgot what it's called it's coal coke yes coal coke we're gonna need that for the next step but as a byproduct it creates creosote oil we're going to need some of that so that is pretty cool this will start working and it's quite slow but you know we have to speed it up let's see if this works this will be fun let's see what we are on no we don't want fast we want faster yeah no we want fastest let's do it let's do it ready let's go ah! let's do it let's do it let's do it what do you think good enough yeah let's try that Mm, didn't work. Didn't work. Darn you, Blue Sunrise. You are privy to our... I don't know. Maybe it is. Let's see. Let's see. Enderman flopping around. We'll never get him. Yeah, there's no way. That's not working at all. So, yeah, he's uh, thwarted us. But that's okay. That's okay. I mean, it is so cheating. It is so cheating, but I love it. I love it. Uh, it just kind of cuts down. So, we are going to come back in a bit when that's all done. And we're going to check our stuff here. Nope, not quite there. I need whale harvestability. Uh, uh, I want this to show. I thought it was whale harvestability, and we actually have that, I thought, in the mod list. Um, let's just check that. Wheel uh, harvestability. Yeah, I do. I don't know. Uh, harvest level tooltip. Let's try that. Let's see if that that's enough. No. I mean, there's growth here, right? So what happened to the percentage of this? I've seen it. Maybe that's only a one seven ten thing. I don't know. I don't know. If you guys know, let me a let me a note. So here's what I'm gonna do. I'm going to maybe make another cold coke oven. And I don't know. We'll see. And yeah, I think I will. I think we'll. I think I'm going to make another uh, set, make it side by side. You'll see what I do. Um, I'll bring her back. Okay, guys. I have created a second one. They are cranking away. It hasn't been that long, right? But it's produced cold coke. It's got creosote oil. Uh, this one I set up a little bit further behind, so it's got a ways to go. But what I have is a fluid tank. I can put in between the two. And let's see if this works. If I were to pull, see, it's pulling the creosote oil directly in there. So that's pretty cool. Now, that's the easiest way to do it. Now, I don't necessarily have a need to do that because I wanted to do a couple of different ways and see which one I like the best. So, I also made myself a drum. Drums are pretty easy to make. Oops, recipe. It's cauldron. Weighted pressure plate, that's just two pieces of iron, so just a bunch of iron, right? Very simple, and it holds a ton. Um, so let's put that down, and we could do this, like right here, and then we could put this uh, right there, right? And so we could pull from both of these, and so I could say export, and I could say extract from here. And so now, there we go, five, five buckets already that is pulled out of here. Out of, and it holds 256 buckets and so as it's cranking away it will just do its thing you can pull out liquid from from right in between the two works really well now what i could also do then so i forgot to show you that i could put a bucket in here and the bucket will fill up and it will dump down here and fill up all right so yeah i screwed up uh you can't fill a bucket out of here but you can put this right here and right so it was pulling from the sides so i have stopped it pulling from the sides but you know what i could do i could pull from the back see it's now filling up and so let me get to clean that up so what i can do is i can put a bucket in here and it gives me a bucket full so that's the way i like to do this this is really just the interface for the big drum that's all i'm doing let's get these out of there and last one there we go so those are all the buckets i have with me uh so the drum is the big storage. It's holding a ton. Let's see if I can get in there. There, there we go. So it's pretty much empty, right? and that's the way we want it. It holds 256 buckets. It will dump into here, or technically get pulled, and awesome. 
So that'll be not what I wanted. Yeah, that's good. Okay, okay. okay. So, um, so this will be my interface that I can then uh, pull the buckets in from. So that's kind of how I like to do it. Now I can hide this a little bit better, and but I don't know. You know, it's not that big a deal. We do need this creosote oil. Why do we need it? Well, you shall see. Let's get over here and nailed it. Ha! Look at that planted it okay because we want to do some cool stuff with power generation now we have we have we have we have the stuff in here where was it did we oh you know what we haven't grown any any uh of the hemp so but that's okay that's okay immersive engineering uh, right, we got the hemp seeds, and a lot of the stuff is predicated on that. Uh, but really, what we want to do is we make the treated sticks, and so we'll need treated planks, and that is use our creosote around wood. So we, because what we want to do is we want to either make a windmill blade, or we want to make a right there water wheel. I, I honestly, I like the water wheel better. The, the windmill looks really cool. We might do one for the aesthetic aspect of it, but for the workhorse, we're going to do water wheels. So, and that's just a bunch of this wood with wood sticks, right? And wood sticks come from the wood here. So let's make some of that up. We've got a bunch of wood in here, actually. Let's just do this. And I'm not going to do any math. I always try to calculate this. Oops, not that. Um, three wood planks. There we go. I always try to calculate it. No, I'm not doing that. I'm just going to start making this stuff. Oops. Actually, let's try this again. And missing. No, 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 no. Let's just do recipe for that. There we go. That'll work. There. Get that out. Put that in the center. Actually, I don't even need to put that in there anymore, do I? Get that, that, and then recipe. There. Okay. So I've got 32 of them. And no, that one. Right. So it's roughly a three to four ratio. Okay, so let's just do that much and see how far we get. And you might say, how, how do you know what you're doing? I don't. I really don't. <laughs> so I'm going to make a water wheel. And uh, so what we can do is water. This is what I'm looking for is the water wheel. So we're going so also going to need some steel. Well, you might ask, how do we get steel? Well, we have a couple different ways. So railcraft extreme reactors and industrial craft all right so the extreme reactors version is i don't think we have any way to actually make it up this steel dust yeah you can pretty much crush that in a crusher or take one of the bars so that's not going to help uh let's see there's the immersive engineering i think i can I don't know if I can. I'm going to try. So the immersive engineering way is what we're supposed to be doing, right? We can take iron with this, with the with the uh, coal coke, and put it in a blast furnace. Uh, we don't have one yet, right? So that's what we're trying to get around. I want to see if we can do any way around this. Not because it's hard or arduous. I'm just having fun, right? I'm just having fun. Just trying to see. Now, the question becomes: Can we take the don't i have some electrical steel in here yes i do i wonder if that will work sometimes it's or dictionary we'll try it i know i know i know i know can we just put it in there no well let me put it in there but we will do this manually there we go and yay nay no darn it so uses have a lot of good stuff but can we grind it down no there's no way to grind this down into any of the dust. Okay, so they have said that your easy way of getting steel in Ender IO is not going to be allowed. So, sorry, Charlie, you have to do it the right way. Okay, that's not a problem, not a problem. So, let's go in here and we'll look at the. Let's go back here and. Oh, gosh, gosh, gosh. Tools and Simples Machines. Nope, I don't think it's there. Uh, construction. Engineers, not there. I did see treated. Let's try treated wood and see what we get from here. Now, do we have? I didn't see anything in here. Tank is pretty cool. The tanks are pretty neat. Um, multi block, multi block. Maybe? Maybe it's under here? Nope, none of those. <sighs> okay, so can I just start typing? Yes, I can. Good, good, good. Okay, so we want a blast furnace. There we go. So, 
We'll start with a crude blast furnace. That's all we can do right now. We need the blaze powder. We need another brick. We have brick. So let me gather up that stuff. And we already have some some brick, but I gotta cook it up. So give me a second. All right. So I made a um, enough for uh, three water wheels. Right. So they're gonna need four of these. So three times four is twelve. So I made twelve. I just had to wait for a little bit more of that to come in. So let's get the um, blast. That's what it's looking for. Blast furnace. So we're gonna work towards the reinforced blast furnace, but it requires um, steel. We haven't made steel yet. So let's get blast brick. And so we're going to need 14, right? Times two is 28. We really need 27 of them. So let's do that. That is exactly what I calculated. Dun, dun, dun. Now, where do we want to put it? We could. I've always thought it would be pretty cool to like put it on top, straddling these two, and then have. So the concept is that we are going to be putting this cold coke into it. So all I have to really do is just do this. And I'm magically done with the power of YouTube. All right, right click in the center block and it makes a crude blast furnace, yay. So what we're going to need to do is we're gonna gather up this cold coke, but we could do it manually, sure, 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 but we don't want to. We don't want to, we want to do it automatically. So we're gonna need a little bit of stuff to do that. So we're gonna need, let's grab, come on, no, no, not that one. Why won't you open? Oh, because it's trying to rotate it, I understand. So let's grab a stack of that, and we should have in our, we'll pause a second to grab an item conduit, so we're done with pressurized fluid conduit. We are going to, I think we're going to try to do this right up here. Chink. Okay, so I should be able to pull from here. And this will connect all the way across, but we don't really, uh, let's see. I don't remember. I thought, wait a minute, wait, 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 wait. They're not going to let me put into it, huh? Oh, no, you're killing me. You're killing me. Yeah. So I remember seeing something about this that uh, they, had, they had removed that. I think we might need the improved one. So, okay, well, we're going to leave these right here because that's at least in theory what we're going to do. So the concept is we're going to pull out the cold coke and put it into here. Now, I don't know if, so the, if you look at the uh, recipe for this guy, or if we were to look in here, this has a, let me go back here. Uh, let's see, that's crude, that one. That one gets us back. Okay, fine, fine, fine. Blast furnace, the improved blast furnace. Um, the recipe actually has a, you see there's a hopper in it. And so uh, if we go up here, right there. Let's stop that. Let's go down one, yay, nay. I'm never quite, let's see, that one, that one. Okay, now can I go, no, yeah, there you go. So the hopper is right there, right? And I think that's what's allowing it to go in. So, okay, fine, 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 we'll do this manually. Okay, let's do that, let's do that. Let's put this in here. So now this is a form of, of uh, coal, right? So this coal has 1600 burn time. This says 3,200 burn time. Remember our red coal has 12,800. So this is at double the amount. So that's pretty cool. If you just run it through here, it's just time. And then you can make a, a, a coal that burns for twice as long. It's pretty, pretty neat stuff. Now we put that in there as a burn agent, as fuel. We put the iron in here. Now let's try the, let's try the acceleration. Oh yeah, there it is. Let's try the acceleration wand on this guy just to see, just to see. I'm going to try it right here. And we're waiting, we're waiting. Nope. Doesn't really help because you can see it's slowly ticking across. All right. So we tried. All right. Well, that's going to make us uh, iron. That's going to make us iron. But unfortunately, guys, we are over our time. We are over our time. So when we come back next episode, let's get a little bouncy here. Bouncy, bouncy, bouncy. When we come back, we are going to finish up our water wheel. We're going to um, maybe make a structure to house it. Uh, that'll be cool. And then once we get enough iron, then we're going to upgrade this furnace. We're going to go to the next level because it's faster and more awesomer. Yes, that is a word. I made it up, and that's what we're going with. Okay, guys. Well, with that said, I bid you adieu, and have a great one. 
Whoa! Uh, no, nobody saw that. Hey, 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 what are you doing? There we go. Whew, that was weird. Okay, guys, I bid you, let's try that again. I bid you adieu, and have a good one. I will talk to you later. Bye!